Hi guys, and welcome to another repair session. We will try to repair this beauty that I scored on the eBay from a nice and uh, cooperative gentleman. We will try to revive this beauty. It is working, but with some troubles. I have to to be honest and say that it's uh, perfect. I I hope it will be a fast uh, repair. It will take longer to take it apart to fix what's needed to be fixed than um, the fix itself. Uh, after the description, and uh, I had time to plug it in. I had the visual inspection, everything is in mint condition, you will see inside soon enough. And um, without further ado, let's go and do this repair. These are from the right side. I will not fiddle it too long. Two screws off. Yeah. Take a little bit of coffee. Yeah, I will rip it around if I don't break anything around here. It's heavy. It's heavy. So I'll have it like this now on this uh, piece of board so you can see that I'm taking the screws off. Uh, I have to, I have to make sure that I'm preparing a better uh, filming position and working bench where I can uh, you know have a proper setup camera setup and stuff so I will not be uh, like I'm now yeah but until then this is all I have, so we still need to do some stuff, you know, we still need to do it, so um, yeah, the, the cover, I don't know how to do it because of this bad uh, camera and bad software that uh, putting an overlay over my screen that's the camera it's not uh, that I should buy the full version for HD and I want to film in HD but I'm not filming and making enough money with filming to buy a full HD stuff and the camera and stuff I'm doing it occasionally if it will be profitable then I will do that but in my case I do something else for a living so I took the the case off sorry for the shaking camera so this is the the inner side I didn't uh, clean it or anything yeah I should uh, try and mount it back not to do that all with this magnification. I don't know why I have magnification. It's no magnification, but this I this camera I use to magnify it for soldering usually. So from a tour, it's like this, yeah. I'll try to zoom out. 
Yeah, let's turn around. Slowly turn around. Yeah. So this is the beauty inside. We need to take it apart. We really need to take apart this front panel. Yeah. So we need to take apart this front panel for this reason. I think in the service manual said that we need to take the screws off some screws off like this screw here and this screw here for for what i noticed after i powered it on before it was that the there are two lamps bulbs inside uh, of this um, class a sign it's nothing bad if they are lit or not it, they are bulbs, they have a limited life and incandescent bulbs, you know, in a special form and like on the old radios, they were using uh, bulbs because they were cheaper at that time LEDs were something fancy it has LEDs, but at that time uh, LEDs were something really fancy and yeah so, I will uh, jump to the case after I uh, took a inspection everything's looking all right even if the age is uh, what it is and we need to change the to change to clean the volume potentiometer that's here and for that we need to take the this off and this front off and i don't have the proper lamps to change it but um, I will find them and that will be maybe another uh, another part at the moment we know we want to try and see if we can fix the scratchy sound that it's producing during the sometimes during the play sometimes it was described like this on the on the auction I don't remember if it was an auction or it, I was just uh, buying it now I have to look on the order but uh, I can say that I had uh, a good uh, a really good um, interaction with the seller so thanks for that and I uh, you're a great great person thank you you know who you are and if uh, I, I, I don't make his uh, name public because I promised that I will not do mm, but uh, he was a really nice person but taking in consideration that for from my experience with a lot of sellers that was a really good experience let's try this So you see the corporate, I think we can try and, and put some lubrification and cleaning without taking it apart because it's a good, uh, it's that type of construction that's open. So we can try to fix it without opening. And regarding the, um, the backlight, uh, it should be here under uh, here right here under the the step so let's uh, put the camera back and try to make a fix trying to 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 spray some um, cleaning stuff on the on the potentiometer there let me try and get uh, get properly closer back to the beginning i need a, i need another another coffee guys look on the youtube channel for merch it's there on the about page if you like to support this channel buy merch it's the one of the form that you can directly support me or donate if you consider that. 
Anyhow, it's appreciated, not necessary. Not necessary, but it's appreciated and it's helping a lot. I need a lot of equipment that's expensive and I don't have it starting from the filming, statives, stuff that everything is expensive. And if you need to do some proper to some proper imaging and stuff, then everything is uh, yeah, expensive. So because I will use a cleaner, an electronic cleaner. I'm not sponsored by them, but I have to use some products if I'm sponsored or no. You know, I'm trying to wear my branding and not make more. Uh, let's try and sneak in a close up look. Let's try and sneak in for a close up look on the. on the work yeah better see better i think we can do even more so it's a stereo potentiometer with some distance tool we will try and enter from top and clean it like this it's properly uh, gravity will do its work you can see it uh, already inside of it uh, 100 kilo linear <laughs> not audio stuff yeah okay let me stop the light here because it was so flary there so i think i can do some justice to this shot using uh yeah another lighting yeah like this too much light so that's for cleaning and i think that's that will fix it for sure we will inspect for other um, other damage i will hope that's nothing because i really like it to keep it in a pristine condition so i'll stand the camera I try to do as much without editing as I can. So guys, this is nice. It will be even nicer if I could have a full picture and not cropped. So I'm using only half of the half of the screen half of the image or something like that even less than half yeah that's the I see that I see it's uh, <laughs> it's filling the screen but uh, the the image is bigger but I'm forced to yeah so that's the way it is I will do, need to look on the screen when I'm panning and not on the and not on the uh, and so I will use it as a tripod. Yeah, great. It's just image stabilization. The tripod. Yeah. So this is the beefy. This is the beefy. Uh, uh, radiator to take out the heat from the power amplification it has a beefy enough power transformer specifications and all the details uh, of the model will be in the description yeah uh, let's continue the panning so we fixed this we fixed this 
Yeah, wherever it will see green. <laughs> I didn't took out the filter, so but look a funny effect, yeah? Razicus BBS. Yeah, Razicus BBS, that's nice. <laughs> yeah, so guys, this looks good, really good. The capacitors are not leaky, not bulged, the fuse is original, transformer is original, everything is original in it. As I told you, the seller was a nice, really nice person. Um, I think it is fixed. I think it is fixed. We will try and see if it's fixed or not. Um, my only problem is that I don't have any copyright free music. Hmm. I have some music made by me, but I don't have it on a source that I can play it on this station. I could use the Bluetooth. Uh, we will see. Okay? Uh, be right back. So guys, with this noise on the background, I don't know if you can hear me well, but with all that said, that was the fix. Yeah, unfortunately it was not a complicated one, it was not a provoke, not a provocation, nothing uh, interesting. To see on this repair but um, remember if you like what you see here maybe it's not really made like uh, with tools of thousands of euros or dollars or euro dollars or whatever it's made with what I have around and with love buy the merch donate do whatever you like but what is free and you can do for sure anyone that is watching can subscribe it's nice and helpful be safe i hope we will have another day and i hope the war will end soon stay safe guys i'm cesar and i'm signing out